Brandon White and I mean, Brandon Brandon White and John Pena. And they right. touch him up. Right away, Brandon's coming out with uh, heavy kicks. You can see he's just going for nice it. Nice dump. Nice dump. Now, John knows that Brandon has two knockouts. Yep. Do you think that that gets in his head a little bit? That, oh, this kid has knockout power. How, how do you think he responds to that? He throws for the bleachers from the outside. I mean, you saw he threw that big knee, and he really, really knows how to upset someone's balance. Yeah. Nice knee on the inside, inside. by John. I think John's gonna try, yeah, John's gonna try to stay inside. Another nice I don't think he wants knee. to be on the long end of those punches. Nice countering, he's trying to go for it right away. Head kick blocked. Nice knees. A lot of power on Brandon, you know, just like really trying to throw him off balance, trying to bully him a bit. Not just power, just his leverage and his angling is really good. Like, you see the way he works those throws. It's just, he's really worked that. Nice counter teep um, by John. Yeah, he really you know, does. He, he does he have. Makes it, he makes it effortless. And that's the, the when you really get into, like, into martial arts, like, you oh, see. Energy transference exactly. and balance rather than and over muscling because that'll exactly. exhaust Exactly. And, it, like, someone who's good at something can be so relaxed and almost lazy at it. And that's almost, it's, he makes those throws look effortless. These both guys have really good conditioned shins because um, John just blocked a really, really heavy leg kick. A little bit, and he just threw a really nice knee too. Yeah, Let's give him yep. some credit where credit's due. Uh, and you know, the conditioning of the shins is so crucial with Thai boxing. There's something called cortical remodeling. It's 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 basically when your shin gets hit so many times that the bone itself becomes like stone. Brand is also carrying a lot more confidence in his eyes right now. He, yeah. He, look at them coming in. He looks like a kid who has a game plan. Nice big leg kick there. John throwing some good knees. John's Brandon again balance. looking for the, yeah. for the yeah. leverage in that clinch. Yep. Cross block. Another cross block. Breaks out of the clinch with a head kick. Great. Doesn't land. Nice big hook there. Spins him. Uses his elbow to get his hands on the inside. Again, it, you can see John trying to tie Brandon up, but Brandon getting that overhead uh, head position, not letting him really get a dominant position in the clinch. Both jockeying position, he out. grabs his head. One thing, though, if you're grabbing someone and you're, and you're tossing him, you can throw a knee before you let him go. And score, you know. Yep. It is. It is a points game. If if it's not gonna, if you're not gonna win by knockout. John seems to be finding his timing now with his punches. Yeah. Now, where your arm and positioning? Oh, oh, oh. head kick. You can't do it as you're holding on. You can knee. Was that a knee to the head or a kick to the he, head? It was a kick. It was, was a kick. When you separate, is going to give him a little bit of time to recover. And Joel Becker, of course, giving him a warning. You know, he doesn't think that the the shot was intentional. You know, just gives him a heads up. Very good uh, refereeing here. You know, always looking out for the safety exactly. of the fighters. John, you know, really trying to come out a little bit more aggressive here. Yep. And it's working for him. Brandon seems to be back on his heels just a touch. Yeah. Um, he's right not able to, yep, not able to get his timing as well. He's hesitant on what he's throwing. Big uh, leg kick by John. 
And that ends I'm gonna say round that. two. I'm gonna Is he say exhausted? That. Like, what is it? Is it is about his health and his safety? Absolutely. Oh. oh. Going for the bleachers on that Superman punch. Okay, Brandon needs to get much more concise about what he's going to throw. He's got to get back in with those straight punches and set up the kicks again. Yeah, the we're single right. shots are not going to work. No, we're, we, don't, we don't know if he was really greatly affected oh, by that. Oh, that, well, that right was a hand. big right hand. Yep. John's looking for it again. Uh, setting up the knees, setting up the knees. The oh, oh head that kick. was a flush head kick. Right hand. John ducks under that shot. Brandon has got to get his hands up. Yeah, you can see his mouth is There's open. There's blood his coming out of Brandon's really, really nose open. right now. Another right hand lands over the top. He's having a hard time keeping his hands up. Yep. Another right hand. Lots of blood coming out of Brandon's nose. You're going to see a standing aid, I think. Yeah, yep. right now. Good call. Good call there, yep. Gavin. Good call on Joel Becker's behalf, too. Test his legs. Again, it is always about the health and safety of the fighters because you know, they're fighters, they have a lot of heart, they'll keep going no matter yep. what. Fighter fights. John looking for a big shot a big there. Shot nice here. overhand right, oh. one, two, lands flush. Spinning back foot, uh, fist lands. Joel's letting him know, you gotta fight, you gotta fight. Now, that's it. That is it, that ends round three. Judge B, 30-27. Judge C, 29-27. Judge A, 29 and 28, all three for your winner by unanimous decision from New York City, Jung Love. Anderson's.